Here's the old school can lights. I'm going to show you how to switch these out in like five minutes to LED. So much brighter and so much better of a look. So here we go. Check it out. So uh, pretty simple to do. You just want to pull them down and you got two little hooks. You want to squeeze them and they come right out. This little gap. Right here they fit in on both sides. So you pop those out and then you got two prongs you squeeze together and it releases. All right, so we're ready to put these in. I did paint the ceiling after I took the old ones out. So I'm gonna show you how to put these in real quick. Like I said, it's less than five minutes for one of these can lights. Super simple. All you gotta do is screw the, the male bulb end right into the female end of your old can light. When I sprayed the ceiling, I did cover these just to be sure nothing got inside there so we get a good connection. All right, if you notice, you got these little clips. If you took out the old ones, you know right where they're at. They go right in there, open up, push it in, done. All right, so I'm just gonna screw this in. like that then I kind of found it just kind of set them on the side of your prongs. okay got each side in one of them now go with the other boom boom make sure nothing's gonna get squished or wedged in between when this goes up Again, remove all the plastic and paper and tape, whatever you've covered with. And we're going to do the same thing. Screw it in. One side in, boom. Then it'll rest on that. It can stand by itself. So next one there, make sure nothing's going to get squished. That goes right up in there, slide it over so that little, this little hook catches on that lip. There you go. And up, boom. That quick. From the 1980s to 2017, you got retrofit LED can lights. Beautiful, nice, bright. In no time. Each one's probably about $25. So they're a little pricey, but you're gonna save on the energy. They don't use half the power that a regular bulb does. It doesn't heat, it, heat your room up. It's just a great thing. One thing I'm gonna tell you, 
I was at Lowe's and saw LED can lights for sale. So I was like, hey, I'm gonna get these. One problem, the light color is in the yellows and orange. The ones up that you're looking at that I just put in are in the daylight right around 5,000. And those are at 2,700 as far as light. So if you want a soft light, go with the uh, soft white. If you want a nice daylight, bright lights, go with the daylight 5,000. All right, so uh, stay tuned. Got a few more to do. And then I'll show you the finished product. All right, got those last four in in the great room here. Let's click that on and see what it's going to look like. Oh yeah, loving it. Nice and bright, bright white, not yellow. If you're like me, I, I like bright, not yellow. I don't want to see everything yellow. I want to see natural light. That is amazing. All right, guys, I wanted to get a quick shot of the difference between the uh, lumens. The one on the, the bottom is the soft white, which is, has a lot of yellow in it. The one at the top is the daylight white, which is like natural light. So... You make the call on what you like best. Let me know in the comments what, which one you're going to use on your can lights. I went with the daylight. So uh, let me know. Hope this was helpful. Oh, let me show you the box. Like I said, I, I went to Lowe's and saw these for $19. I was like, what a bargain, LED lights. Awesome. But the problem is soft white, yellowish. There's a gauge. That's what this one is. 2700K. The ones I'm using are in the daylight range at 5000K. So, uh, hope that helped. All right, so there's the difference. There's the bright white, daylight, no yellow, all natural light, bright white. Um, it is pretty bright, so uh, I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm, I got a special uh, dimmer switch for LED, so I'm gonna be installing a, a dimmer switch so they can be dimmed down at night or whatever. Hard to put a dimmer on these, but uh, I'm going to show you how to install a dimmer in case you want to get the bright white daylight, natural light. You can dim it down so it's not bright all the time, but if you need light, you got it. I like that. So uh, hope that helped. Enjoy your new LED retrofit can lights. Can't go wrong. Pay for themselves. All right, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you learned something. So when you go to replace your can lights with some retrofit LEDs, it makes it a lot easier. So uh, if you like the video, hit the like button. If you're not a subscriber, please subscribe. Uh, I'm doing all kinds of videos, tips and tricks from drywall, texturing, painting. So uh, if you've got a question, hit me up on the discussion section of here on YouTube here. And we'll see you.